I think it was in 2000, 2001, I had a stroke in 2000 and kind of started getting more involved with art and just checking it out and seeing, because I didn't grow up artistic at all, so it was, it just kind of came on and then kind of developed and it was always like a side project and uh, just the last couple years that has been more serious than I think Robert Rauschenberg was like kind of the first artist I had found like probably 10 years ago and kind of that, he kind of sparked the whole thing and that wow, like this can be art, you know, because I didn't really grow up around art too much. And There's an idea behind it sometimes, but it's also kind of, yeah, just the process of, from building it with you know, with the wood of building a, a panel and then it becomes like a paper collage process and paint and sanding and kind of just some of the old imagery behind it, it kind of develop a storyline behind it. There's a lot of old family photos or found images from magazines and newspapers. I think just just everyday people and stories like kind of intrigue me the most. Just the the hidden mysteries behind why someone turns out the way they do. Or I think real life's pretty complicated and interesting compared to you don't really need to make anything up. Like crazy things happen in real life, so it's kind of it's cool to explore. And just getting older. And as you watch your family get older, like the people, you know, that you grew up with, it's, it's kind of interesting that you kind of, just the bond is strong. Just change in life and, I don't know, just get, and getting older and like right now I feel not invincible, but like I feel like nothing's, everything's going to stay like this for a while, but I know that can't happen. That, yeah, and that impermanence of, of everything. I'd say just, just have fun and just do what you want to do. It's kind of, it's a tough, it's like a slippery slope of trying to make stuff marketable or accessible or to do exactly what you want. So I would say just do what you want. and. I think if you're true to yourself and true to the process that some cool stuff's going to come out of it.